What is up everyone? This is Sorokin09 and today it is my birthday. Every year I make a birthday video for those who don't know who I am and what day it is that it is my birthday and I am currently 25 years old. I'm quarter of a century and I am just getting older by the day but none the wiser. So what has been happening since last year? Well, currently, now I have two jobs. So, that means that I have less time to actually make videos and live streams, which is completely fine. That when I have more money to be able to pay for more stuff and as well as to be able to save for the future, that is what's more important right now. I know that YouTube may or may not work for me, but what I'm looking into doing in so far, maybe hopefully soon, that I should do some voiceovers or voice acting. That countless of people, over and over and over again, whenever I'm at work, they say that I have a nice voice and I should use that to make something out of it so hopefully i'll be able to do something about that this year or maybe in the next year it really depends on how things go maybe this is going to be the year but let's just see when time goes by that if i'm able to go into voiceovers or voice acting then that's the thing that I could actually possibly do on top of everything else that i've been doing right now that it would be a nice little change of pace because a lot of things that a lot of people have been saying that you should be on radio, you have that great voice. But the thing is, is that I really don't want to go on radio. It's kind of funny and ironic in a sense that I would rather just be doing something like this than to doing radio or something along the matters of that. But if I'm actually doing any voiceovers or voice acting, I could actually work on making YouTube videos while doing that as a behind the scenes. And then, of course, that I could upload that for more content on YouTube. I want to, I still want to grow my YouTube platform. But it's going to be a little bit of a time before that's going to actually happen. But in the meantime, I could just possibly do some meme videos or just reading off some of the scripts or maybe reading off some stories I could actually possibly do. And just for more practice, because I have no idea where to start, really. Like, how do people get into voiceovers or voice acting? Please let me know in the comment section below. Like, how does that work? Do you have to find people who are willing to work with you or you just pretty much put yourself out there and hope? Hopefully somebody will find you. Again, I have no idea how any of that works, but maybe just for this year, I could just do some little bit of meme videos, reading scripts, or just doing some other videos little bit by little bit by little bit as I get more practice and hopefully that I can get some feedback from you guys or from my friends who come across this video or any other video that I do post up. I just need feedback. I just need to know what to do exactly. But... Just for any changes right now, I'm currently taking a little bit of a break from school as I'm working two jobs, so I'll be able to save up more money. All I gotta do is just take three more classes, then I get a degree in media art, which, of course, all those three classes is gonna be all scientific classes. Anything that has to do with science and biology, each class is gonna be three hours long, so I'm just gonna take a little bit of a break so I don't stress out myself too much out of this time period. And for the live streams, I hope to at least get one live stream per week. Week. And I'm able to keep up with that mainly because that only in a few hours of free time that I do have given a week, I'm able to actually do a live stream. I've been working every single day for nearly two weeks, coming up to three weeks in a row, just every single day. And I'm not complaining about it. I'm able to at least save up some money to put onto the side, paying off some of my debt. And once that debt is paid off, I'm going to put myself back into debt when I actually buy a brand new TV. That's one of the things I really want to get. I'm going to get a brand new 4K TV. And once that happens, and I'm going to be more happy about that with that TV is going to be there for another five years before we're going to go to 8K, right? Because we're going to 4K, then we're going to 8K, and then we're going to go to 16K, 32K. I'm guessing that it's going to be to the point where everything is going to be so realistic. It feels like you could actually just jump into the screen and be a part of the action there. But just for every single day, I call it, I actually call it full time slash part time. Full time in the fact that it is every single day that I've been working. Part time because it's usually just five to six hours. At some days, I actually got eight hours and just the lowest amount of hours, four hours. But it's still pretty much like full time. And I'm very happy about that. That I could at least have some financial stability. Again, I'm going to pay off some of my debt. And then afterwards, I'm going to put myself back in debt. But at least it'll be more manageable and very fast. It'll be very fast to pay all that off anyways. And once I buy that new TV, I'm thinking that that's going to be the last thing I'm going to buy. That's very, very expensive for a long time. Unless if I actually buy a brand new camera. 
I don't, I like this camera, but everyone's using the DSLR cameras, the Canon cameras with the Rode microphone. So I don't have to use this setup. I could just use the other setup. And one thing I really want to buy also is that I'm going to try to buy a brand new light. So if I ever get into vlogging where I'm able to do that more on my free time, then I want to be able to get that circular light. Right now I have the box light right in the corner. So that's why you see the little reflection there. And it wouldn't be so bad once I get the circular light, but we're just going to have to wait little bit by little bit. If I'm very serious about continuing to vlog like this, then I'll go invest in making, well, a payment towards a circular light and which will actually get a better lighting in my room. But that is all I could really say right now. I know I went to a good tangent about just jobs and voice acting and things like that so in a recap that i really want to get into voice acting and voiceovers so if i could at least use my voice for something then that could be a thing that I could actually do i got a professional microphone right here and as well as that i have pretty much some free time throughout the night Usually I go from the mornings up until night and the rest of the night I have a little bit of free time, whether it be at least, I would say three hours. I could easily get a voiceover recording done in that time and then send it off to people if they need to get a voiceover there. But I need more feedback and I need more practice. I have no idea how to get into it. I need to learn how things are done so that I could have more experience in that field and maybe one day I could actually work on that professionally. But until then, that's going to be another part-time. If I actually get that as a third job, that would be nice. I cannot consider YouTube as a job yet because it's not making enough earnings in a month to classify it as an actual job. So far, it's just a hobby. Right now, I just consider YouTube a hobby. If I'm able to do at least one live stream a week, then that is good. If I'm able to do some videos throughout the month, then that's even better. But just for people thinking that I'm doing this full-time, this is not a full-time deal. You can only consider it as a full-time job if you're actually making enough to live out on your own. And if that's not the case, it's a hobby. So, YouTube will be treated as a hobby. If it becomes a professional career in the future, then I have you guys to thank for all the support. But, overall... That's pretty much what's been going on so far. You can consider this as a vlog, but I just keep one video a year just for this birthday. I'm currently 25 years old. I have two jobs. YouTube is a hobby. I may be looking into doing voiceovers and voice acting. So if you guys have any advice to give me, then let me know where to look, how to do things. And hopefully maybe one day I'll be able to use this voice to do something like that. And then what else is there? Just for the gaming aspect, I want to try at least do one live stream per week as given the days off or not even the days off with the free time that I've been given that again, full time, part time. I'm working every single day, which once all the debt has been paid off, once I get new things right there, I'm just going to be so happy that once it's all here. If I'm able to do vlogging more and more, then I'll probably just buy a brand new circular light with the other lights. I'll probably just give them away to a friend, but that is all for today, and I hope you enjoyed this rambling of a vlog of a video of my birthday. So happy birthday to me. I'm a quarter century year old, just 25 years old, and I'm just getting older by the day. But until then, have a great day. I've been Zorkings Around Zero, and then as always, I'll see you guys next time in a new video or live stream.